Hello and welcome to our website and this short webinar. The main goal of this webinar is to explain what we are seeing is the biggest problem in the sales today. So you can really understand does it also applies to yourself or not. And in the end we would like to introduce our Sales Mastery Online course and explain to you how it can really help you with your sales. This webinar has been divided into three parts. First of all we would like to bring out for who actually our Sales Mastery course has been designed for. And as mentioned, what really is the biggest problem we see in the sales today? After that, shortly about the people behind our course. And in the end, we would like to take the first look to our approach to the sales management, which is the concept of the sales pipeline. And we would also take the time and explain to you our course structure and how it's really been built up for you. So for who actually our Sales Mastery Online course has been intended for? On the first hand, it has been designed for the salespeople who are struggling to meet their company's sales targets, or they are struggling with some particular sales activity. Let's say they are struggling to find new leads or buyers, or they are having hard times of getting reply from those code leads. It is also for sales professionals who want to rise to the position of the sales director in our organization but are feeling that they really, really lack of that big feature of how the company's sales processes are working. And it is also for entrepreneurs who want to improve their company's sales results, expand customer base or who really want to build up their own team or sales department inside their company. And in the end it is for everyone who really wants to get better at sales via systematic approach and practical instructions. So what is the biggest problems we are seeing today in the sales? So really the lack of the big picture and systematic approach is a widespread problem in companies big and small in different industries. Also we see that many beginner sales professionals are taking the sales as a chaotic and unpredictable activity, which is absolutely not true. And now I would like that you take some time and think about the following key questions and KPIs about your own company's sales, so you can really understand how systematic it is currently and how much information you actually have. So do you know what is your current close rate when you're submitting offers, or where your leads are coming from and what are the quality of the leads for the different sources. Or very important, do you know in which stages and why the inquiries are tying in your company during the sales? It's a very important question, by the way. Or how you are actually qualifying your leads? Do you have a process for that? Or how many leads you can get every day? And how many of these leads will finally ask a real inquiry from you? And how long it takes? Or how many offers you are submitting every day, week or month? And maybe the most important question in, in this list is Do you know who is your ideal customer? And how much you actually know about them and how? Have you ever created a customer persona or profile in your company? And in the end, can you describe how is the whole sales journey organized and built up in your company? If you can't answer to some of those uh, important questions, then there is a big chance that also in your company there is a lot of improvement in your sales processes. And our course can really help you with that. So why the systematic approach is so important in the sales? It is actually very simple because all the problems in the sales and marketing are starting when there is a lack of systematic approach. And it is not right just to focus on and be really good at on a few individual sales activities, for example in lead generation or persuasion. Because in real life, the sales works as a conveyor system or as a sales pipeline, as we call it. And there are about eight main consecutive stages in the sales management. In each of those stages, there are different activities where different kinds of skills and knowledge are important. And, is, and it is totally enough when there is problem in one stage of your sales and you can be very sure that your whole sales will suffer. 
For example, let's say you are a salesman dealing with a bunch of cold leads. But maybe the person who did the lead collection for you, maybe he, he was doing not good job and maybe the leads are not properly selected for your company. Maybe they are not matching your company's scopes, scope or uh, customer persona. And in this case, you as a sales manager, no matter how good job you do, you really can't get much out from these leads. So it's really important that during the sales journey, in every stage, everything has been done in the correct way. But who are we to make a, such a bold statement about the problems in sales and uh, dare you to teach about the sales? Let's a little bit talk about us. First of all, I am one of the main creators behind our Sales Master Online course. But we have many other active entrepreneurs and sales professionals in our team. All of whom we have contributed our valuable experiences and knowledge into this Sales Mastery Online course. I am an active serial entrepreneur from Europe and I have more than a decade of experience under my belt in international business. And I have started my first journey when I was just 16 years old. I am active and experienced in international business between Europe and Asia but more recently also doing business with African and South American companies. I am active in both ways, as a direct exporter, importer, as well as agent. But actually there was also time in my life when I was working in corporations and I have held several positions in European companies, sales and marketing departments. I have started as a salesman, moved on to the sales management, and, in, and uh, in the end, I have also been a sales director of many European corporations. And I can very surely confess that one of the biggest factors for my own success, either as a businessman or as an employee, has really been the good and systematic sales skills. I am also holding a degree in international business, but based on my own experiences and based on the colleagues of mine, I can, I can say that the real practice is what really matters in the business and sales. Currently, I deal with different kinds of goods. I trade goods in the following sectors, with machinery and equipment, custom-made production lines, raw materials, electronics, vehicles, consumer goods. And as you can understand, each of those sectors has its own specifics. I'm also very experienced with project-based sales. If some of you may know, then the project-based sales can be considered as the most complex one. It's also very technical, and the uh, sales journey with, uh, with those cases can be very long, because in such cases the customer itself don't clearly know yet what kind of product or solution they want to purchase. Instead, they have criteria and the requirements in place. Also, I am currently operating companies in Europe and Asia and handling deals in large amounts up to hundreds of thousands of dollars. And here are just some moments from my own journey, and not as an employee, but as a businessman. And as you can see, I'm doing lots of business with uh, Asian and with Chinese companies. Example, in this photo, uh, I was signing a deal to order a specific production line dedicated for European customer and that deal was was over three hundred thousand dollars and it was already several years ago. If you would like to learn more about people behind our website and our courses then you are free to go to our website and read more about us. Now let's talk about our approach to the sales management, the sales pipeline. So why, why it's called the sales pipeline after all? It's because the stages of the sales and processes taking place in these are actually all interconnected and consecutive. So normally all the new leads and inquiries are following through the whole sales pipeline and shortcuts are really rare and mostly possible with old and repeat customers. And visually all of this can be actually very well imagined as a pipeline or as a funnel where on the one side the code leads and inquiries are going in and from the other side some inquiries materialize as real orders and some leads become real customers and even repeat customers. 
So the sales pipeline as a concept is actually a tool for you which allows you to organize the sales in your company effectively. And your goal as a sales professional is to maximize the output of real orders and customers and repeat customers from that sales pipeline. And this can be done in the following ways. First of all, you are optimizing and improving the processes and activities in the different stages in your sales pipeline. Secondly, feeding your pipeline with as appropriate leads and RFQs as possible. This can be done if you create a dedicated customer persona in your company and your lead generation is strictly following that. In our course, of course, we are showing you how you can create your own customer persona. And in the end, you should regularly feed your pipeline with new leads and if possible, try to increase their leads going in every day. And the best news for you as a sales professional is that you can actually build your own sales pipeline, your own sales machine, as we call it. And all the activities and processes taking place in that pipeline can be fine-tuned and improved. And this concept actually works in every field, companies big and small, and absolutely no matter what you want to sell. And everything can be measured and analyzed if you use the right metrics and KPIs and asking the right questions. And finally, if you know the statistics of your pipeline and how much material is in currently, then it is actually possible to forecast the sales in money value for future periods. As you can imagine, this can be very, very beneficial for you as a sales professional. And in our online sales master course, we are exactly showing you how you can build your own sales pipeline. And now we believe that it is right time to take the first look of that sales pipeline itself. Because during the Sales Mastery Online course, we are handling the sales pipeline in detail and breaking it all down for you, so you can build your own system. So this is the sales pipeline or sales funnel, as we call it. As you can see, this kind of system really gives you a complete overview how the sales processes are taking place uh, in any kind of company, actually. Starting from the lead, uh, lead sources and ending with actual designed orders and hopefully uh, repeat customers. And in each of those stages, different kinds of activities are taking place and different kinds of skills uh, are playing their roles. For example, in this yellow part, the communication, persuasion and negotiation skills play a huge role in these stages. Also, in different stages, different metrics can be used to, uh, to actually measure how well uh, you are doing in those, those stages. And because really, uh, it's a very wide topic, then we have divided this whole sales pipeline into different sections, different modules, and in the Sales Mastery Online course, we are going to cover each of those stages to you in detail. We are going to handle all the activities, all the skills you need, and also giving you all the resources and tools you should use in different stages of this, of this pipeline. We can say for sure that most of the sales professionals do not have this kind of complete overview and strategy, how to actually organize and and execute the sales in the company. So if you have if you have organized the sales systems and processes in the same way in your company then we guarantee to you that you are going to get really good results, whatever you are selling. So this will be the main topic of the Sales Mastery Online course to take you through to this whole sales pipeline from the very beginning to the end. And because really the, this topic is very wide, then we have, we have divided it into the modules, the lessons. And there are eight, eight modules in our Sales Mastery Online course. All the modules are coming from the right order, starting from the beginning of the sales pipeline, moving on to the, to the end. In each module of the Sales Mastery Online course, we are handling topics, tactics, skills and tools relevant and crucial only to that particular sales stage. 
and in each module there are also additional downloadable materials, resources, tools and practical examples for you. And, and, and uh, at the end of each lesson, each module, there are action steps and instructions for you which we suggest you execute as soon as possible because really in the sales what really matters is taking action. It's not, not enough just the learning or reading or watching what we are going to teach you in the program. What really matters is that you put this into action in your own organization. Also, our Sales Mastery Online course comes with the option for you to ask personal advice and questions about the sales. So all the questions rele relevant uh, to sales are welcome to our email and someone from our team will get back to you and advise you. And as mentioned, we have eight modules, eight lessons in our Sales Mastery Online course covering each and every stage in that sales funnel which we just showed to you. So for next, maybe I will show you how our online learning platform looks like because actually all the lessons uh, are available in our learning platform which you will for which you will get your own personal account once you enroll into our program and now we are in inside of the learning platform where you can see all these modules listed for you and under each module or each lesson there are also additional materials for you and uh, once you enroll you will get you will have access to all of those modules instantly Also very important for you to know that time to time we are updating uh, the course and adding some extra materials into this program and for all the students who have already enrolled into this Sales Mastery Online course these updates, updates will be free of charge so we are not going to charge you extra if we update something or if we, if we add some new materials for you so this is like bonus, bonus for you and as we mentioned before, uh, at the end of each, each module, there are actually, we are giving you the action steps and instructions you should take. So just to give you an example, this is the uh, module number two. At the end, we are giving you the action steps, what you should do after this stage. And also we are giving you the goal, what you should achieve at the end of this, uh, this module or this lesson. Of course, uh, you, are, you are in no hurry to complete these lessons. You can, you can study the materials in your own pace uh, as you have your own time based on your own schedule. Also, once you have created a personal account in our online, online learning platform and enrolled in our course, then you will have your personal dashboard. And in that dashboard, you, you can see all the details uh, about yourself and your account and you can see all the courses where you have been enrolled also you can track your progress and in the end once you uh, uh, complete some of our programs then you will get also the certificate from our side and this is it we have reached the end of this webinar and if you now really feel that you would like to learn about the sales in a systematic way and also get all the instructions and tools for it then really our Sales Mastery Online course can really help you with that Thank you very much for your attention and we are looking forward to seeing you in our Sales Mastery Online course